Wes Streeting and Sir Ed Davey are complaining. And uh, the Liberal Democrat leader is particularly complaining to Ofcom about bias in the GB News Department. That's like, uh, <laughs> that's like claiming that a snake has suddenly become venomous. And uh, it, 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 it's nonsensical. It's nonsensical. Why complain about GB News about this? And they're complaining specifically because Nigel Farage and Jacob Rees-Mogg uh, have been lampooning the Lib Dem leader and indeed the leader of the opposition about their failure in the post office department. Uh, Wes Streeting says, I, I think what's actually happened in the last week or two in particular is the government have tried to sling mud at everybody else. They're trying it with Sir Keir Starmer, they've tried it with Ed Davey, and I think it's unedifying, actually. In fact, it's rather summed up by Pretty Patel's rather hopeless claim that all the problems with the Horizon software lay in the hands of Labour and the Lib Dems. No, 17 uh, postal ministers, of which only a few were Labour and Lib Dem. The rest were Conservative, and none of them really did anything to help and that's the point. Now, my concern here is not that too much attention has been moved away from the Conservatives. That is certainly true. My concern is that um, uh, Ed Davey seems to think that it's wrong that he's being targeted and asked why did he not meet people when they asked to meet? Why was he so dismissive of Alan Bates, for example? Uh, and, uh, and similarly, why did... Um, Sir Keir Starmer not do as much as he could have done, uh, particularly when he was um, in charge of prosecutions. Uh, one of the cases certainly took place, uh, was not a private prosecution. One of the cases was, was done under, uh, uh, effectively under his watch. So uh, the fact that, oh, well, you know, we didn't do as much, we, we didn't do as much harm as other, as other people. It doesn't matter, you still did harm or you still didn't do good. And I think that needs to be called out. Now, uh, is, is Rhys Mogg the person to be calling out um, Ed Davey or indeed uh, Sir Keir Starmer? Is Farage the person to be calling these out? Well, perhaps not, but the fact that... Um, uh, that these people are being called out is quite right. These people should be called out. And I said last night, we've got so obsessed with this tribal uh, approach to politics that we've forgotten the fact that actually not doing enough is not doing enough. And Lee Anderson, uh, Lee, Lee Anderson claims that he's going to be impartial and then used a question in the House of Commons to call on Sir Ed Davey to quit on Wednesday. Well, yeah, why not? Sir Ed Davey didn't do his job well enough when he was uh, minister in charge of postal services. Being a minister comes with responsibility and it's an honour. And if you don't take your responsibility seriously enough, it doesn't matter whether other uh, ministers who follow in your footsteps don't take their responsibilities seriously enough. <laughs> the issue is, what did you do? What did you do? Did you do enough? For example, I would say the same thing to Nadine Dorries and to uh, Dowlin and to Matt Hancock and to all those people. What, 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 what is his name? Hunt. Hunt was also all those people who occupied the DCMS ministry and did nothing. Not to say uh, anything about the, the current um, uh, people who control that ministry. Nothing. Nothing. And it doesn't mean one is any... The, the fact that the next one is worse than the previous one uh, exonerates the previous one. No. They all have a responsibility. And if they all fail, they all fail. It doesn't make one any better than the other. There is an absolute standard. And the absolute standard is that people do their best. And when people don't meet the constituents and the people who are, uh, who are um, suffering and who know a good deal about what this 
uh, ministry involves and what this ministry is supposed to be uh, supervising and controlling, and they refuse to meet the people or only meet them in a uh, in an offhand way, and then only after tons of letters have have been exchanged. Yeah, that minister should be held to account. So yes, Ed Davy. Time to really think about the responsibilities you were given and the failure that you demonstrated in office.